This conference will now be recorded. Yeah, this session is to explain open text solution with the S4 HANA PPM portfolio project management. So this solution we are calling as a extended ECM. Okay. So here uh, in portfolio project management itself, we are having functionality where we can upload the document with reference to objects like in the item or in the initiative portfolio buckets you can directly upload the document or you can you can link your created document from sap dms document management system to your object in ppm okay but apart from that to manage the documents uh in open text okay sap uh that open text has given one solution which we are calling as extended ecm so through this solution okay when when the open text and ppm is integrated okay you will see one 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 tab okay one tab in your portfolio object called extended ecm where you will see all the all, all the details of your document which you are which you are uploading with reference to object in one work space so here we are going to discuss about all the scenarios first i'll explain what is the eppm okay and then next stage i'll explain how we can see the process here in the ppm or ppm and open text integration okay so here uh, i will go through of one one slide demo okay and i'll try to explain everything accordingly so here agenda of this session to explain what is eppm enterprise portfolio project management okay and then functionality overview then next you'll go for extended ecm demo with ppm solution okay so first of all to understand enterprise portfolio project management okay so you might be here this terminology in in your in, in in industry that eppm we are looking for one candidate or we are looking for some solution uh in eppm so this terminology is very generic nowadays so basically in sap eppm that is the enterprise portfolio project management is a combination or is a group of multiple modules with an sap okay so here if you can see in the slide enterprise portfolio project management is a combination or a group of four major modules okay first is the project system which is a core module your all core modules are integrated with ps project system so this is a controlling module okay and apart from that we are having portfolio project management that is a ppm portfolio and project management okay so through this portfolio project management uh yeah so through portfolio and project management you can manage your portfolios and projects okay uh and through cpm commercial project management when you are when you are saving any product or services to your customer to manage this kind of projects you can use the cpm okay and fourth one is the epc enterprise project connector if you are looking to integrate your eppm mainly project system with p6 or msp p6 means primavera or msp microsoft project in that case you can use epc enterprise Pro enterprise project connector okay so these all four modules comes within eppm okay so eppm basically it's giving giving you uh, the 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 functionality to manage your portfolio to manage your project okay any kind of project whether it is investment project or cost project or customer project okay so any kind of project you can manage through eppm next if you look into that complete uh, enterprise portfolio and project management in s4 hana available modules so here in this slide it's explained that uh, these all four modules how it is going to be integrated with other module in sap uh, here commercial project management it's providing the provision to manage your project within work space so here you can see project work space and in issue and change management we are having uh to functionality to manage your issues and change management to manage your changes in the project okay and you can manage the risk you can do the financial plannings 
and you can do you can manage your procurements within ppm itself okay and then another module is portfolio project management which is having uh, two some module one is a portfolio management another is a project management so portfolio management is to manage your portfolio okay so when 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 you are going for any any project so before even starting this project how this project is going to be aligned with your portfolio how it is going to be aligned with your organization strategies in that case we are using portfolio management to 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 to, to calculate uh to calculate the, the possibility of successness of your project okay. so here uh you can see the reports and analytics and then yeah it is going to be integrated with project system and project system is integrated with other controlling modules okay like fico it is integrated with sd it is integrated with mm okay all core modules it is integrated and then epc enterprise project connection okay that is a that is uh, to integrate with MSP and Primavera. Next, is this EPPM, Enterprise Portfolio Project Management, we are having four modules, PPM, CPM, EPC, and PS. Before S4 HANA 1709, these all modules, okay, this, this project system was a part of core, However, PPM, CPM, and EPA, EPC, we were having a choice or we were having a provision to, to integrate your PS, that is a core ECC system through add-on or as an individual server. Okay. So there was a there was a provision, let's say if it is an ECC server which is having the project system, and if you want to uh, if you want to implement ppm cpm or epc so we were having a provision to keep these individual modules as a add-on on the same ecc system okay and uh, yes to communicate any 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 data between ppm cpm and epc with ps okay there was rfc being used okay and uh, same way when we were keeping a separate server for these modules ppm cpm and epc okay definitely yes we have to integrate with uh, rfc remote function call okay and uh, before s4 hana 1709 ppm cpm and epc they were having individual licensing also okay but after s4 hana 1709 version these all are the part of core and there is no need of having a separate license of any specific module okay everything is coming with s4 hana license only okay so here yeah this is the best because you can you can utilize all the functionalities which we are having in the ppm okay uh, after getting all these modules at one place in the core system no need to go for any any separate licensing so we are we, we are having more choice to 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 implement as per our organization suitabilities okay next is yeah so how open text extended ecm solution is helping or what exactly this solution is providing us so here i'll i i try to just show uh, how when when this extended ecm solution is implemented it will be directly integrated with portfolio project management and you will start to see one additional tab in ppm objects with the name of extended ecm so once you are clicking there it will take you to the workspace workspace is the place where the object additional information from open text can be displayed at one place and sap information also can be kept at one place so the combined data you can see and you can visualize you can navigate to to ppm side or to open text side okay you can communicate the data you can communicate you can transfer the data from open text to ppm or ppm to open text also but some of solution are customized it doesn't come with the standard solution okay and next let's go for the extended ecm process overview i'll just take one one scenario here and yes this is just disclaimer whatever the uh, whatever the ppt or whatever the the process i'm going to show it's taken from 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 open text website only okay we are not authorized 
to to develop anything from that side without permission of open text okay uh, and we are not any uh, legal company or to to just to just uh, to to summarize the licensing and all this is just separate part i am just trying to explain how the functionality is helping us in ppm to 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 overcome with some of uh, business real requirement okay that is my main purpose here just a second so here i'm going to just display okay one second yeah okay so let me let me share my screen okay these all demo scenarios you can see online okay you can you just need to go with this address okay i'll keep it in my chat box here okay and you can see you you can also navigate to all all these scenarios to just familiarize to just familiar with all the all the process steps here so here uh, these are the demo scenarios browse portfolio buckets and portfolio items in sap then browse portfolio buckets and portfolio items in smart ui create portfolio item related project in sap create project page and task with workspace in sap assign resources in sap see roles in smart ui work with project in extended ecm web ui create port project plan from template and use approval workflow search documents from the landing page navigate from portfolio item to the engineering projects okay so here by going through of all kind of demos you will be uh, able to understand that how open text extended ecm solution is helping us in portfolio project management business process okay so i'm just taking one example browse portfolio bucket and portfolio items in sap okay and how you can see work is space in the open text so here I'm just clicking here, okay. And uh, uh, this is the scenario where you are just attaching some documents to the portfolio bucket, okay. And uh, you are attaching the documents to the portfolio items, okay. But being a manager, you just want to see all the document at one place in your workspace. So based on the role, okay, we can provide the access of workspace to the individual user, and they can see all these details at one place in workspace in open text. And when they are navigating through the document, it will take you to the portfolio object also. So here, let's go to the next. So it's just shown as a landing page for the individual transaction. I'm going with the portfolio management. Okay, portfolio structure. Okay, here is the portfolio structure. Okay, and to switch to your own portfolio, you just need to go to the portfolio. Switch portfolio, you select here your portfolio, go to OK and here you just need to open this and open the bucket structure 